Welcome back to Kiwi and Pixel the Parakeets. Today I'm going to do a little bit of a video on how to deep clean your birdcage. So we use the Vision bird cages, the M02 and the L01 bird cages, and um, they're really good cages overall. They're fairly easy to clean on a routine basis, but today I went ahead and did a deep cleaning, which is not something we have to do terribly often. First of all, what I do is the at the very beginning is I pull the cages apart by lifting these uh, tabs here on all sides, and I pull the top of the cage off. And from there, what I do is I uh, take out the bottom grate, the metal grate on the bottom, and I clean it off with a wet paper towel. So a lot of people will, uh, you know, use a vinegar compound of some sort to uh, clean their cages, but I just use plain water. I find that the Vision bird cages are sort of like non-stick in a way, where if you use water, the stuff comes right off of them. So. Anyway, you'll see I have some wet paper towels, a big roll of paper towels. You tend to go through a lot of them. And I go ahead and I wipe everything down inside the cage, um, including the bottom of the tray and everything else. So I remove the paper. You have to get in between the grill bits a little bit to get out the, uh, the bird poop. And then once everything's cleaned off, I put new paper in, I put the grill back on, and I set that portion aside. Then you get to the tough part. This is the cage assembly itself, including the plastic guards, the door, all the things on the interior of the cage, and the top. Overall, if you use a wet paper towel, it's pretty easy for the most part to get the things like the guard and the bars themselves. But when you start getting into the uh, edges here, the small nooks and crannies, it gets a little bit harder. So you've got a couple things in here that there's a little bit of a lip where the uh, cage bars fit into. They trap a lot of stuff. You gotta really get in there with a tiny bit of paper towel and really push it up into the crevices and get them nice and wet. And then you can scrub it around a little bit. You should get everything out. Next, you have the uh, food door area. And I find that the inside of the food door gets very dirty. We do clean these on a regular basis, but sometimes they need a deep cleaning. A couple things about that. You also have these crevices under here that sort of go up. They're a very small crevice, and you need to get paper towels inside of those nice and wet so that you can uh, clean those out. Uh, there's a lot of buildup over time. You do want to get those nice and clean. The challenge here with using wet paper towels and water is you have to make sure everything is dry before you put it back together. I can't emphasize this enough. You don't want mold or anything growing, <clears throat> excuse me, growing in the cages where it shouldn't be. So I always make sure to use a lot of dry paper towels to dry everything out once I've used the wet paper towels to actually do the cleaning. So looking at the top of the cage, that's pretty easy, scrub down. But in the process of cleaning the cage assembly, you gotta get really inside, here we go, inside the top here because surprisingly stuff ends up in there as well. So we've got the cage bottom as well. There's a lip down here. There's stuff that accumulates in here. And there's stuff that accumulates along the edge. This little corner right here, it's hard to see on camera, but tends to trap a lot of stuff. A wet paper towel, really push it into the corner. And then you got it. Next thing are the toys and the perches. Pretty easy. Anything that looks dirty, I remove it and I clean it. The wood perches are a little bit harder. I try not to use too much water on them. I don't soak them, I just use the paper towel. On the other hand, the uh, green plastic perches, they twist off and they come right out. You can run these under hot water and you can just dry them off with a paper towel. This one did not get super thoroughly cleaned, but it will in a minute. Then of course you have things like the clips, the latches, Make sure those are all clean as well. And I'm trying to think of anything that I missed. Of course, in the process of uh, reassembling the cages, the birds climb all over them and poop where you just cleaned. So uh, the joys of bird ownership, of course. So anyway, there we have it. There's Pixel being all cheeky. He's doing a little bit of a molt right now. And Kiwi's doing flips because he wants out. So we'll say hi to, say hi to Kiwi here. All right. I think he just wants to socialize with Pixel this morning. Good bird. Good bird. That's right. 
So anyway, uh, if you have any questions about cleaning your birdcage, feel free to leave them in the comments. If you like this video, hit that like and subscribe button, and make sure to click the little bell so that you get notified every time we make a video. Thanks for coming back and watching Kiwi and Pixel the Parakeets.